beautiful. So what we have here, it is. Yes, these ones, let me just grab them on the top, right? Okay. Yes, lovely. So this right here, I'm going to actually show you guys how to put together a centerpiece of flowers. So this is really cool because um, I was telling um, Yang that uh, <laughs> I actually worked in a flower shop. It was called Queen Bee Flowers on Granville and 11th. This was about maybe two Christmases ago. It was for a TV show um, for Interact called Together for the Holidays. So I kind of semi know how to put a centerpiece together. This is really cool because it already comes with, um, what would you call this? This, um, oh, scary. <laughs> Hi, Charlie. You want to see me put the centerpiece together? Yes. So it already comes with this and I should know this and I, what is this? This is the um, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I should know this, but hey, we don't know things all the time. It'll come to me. So this is what you get when you make that artificial centerpiece for your flowers. So it'll come with this piece already. Mm -hmm. Yes, right here. That's, that's called um, um, well. That's a good question. <laughs> yeah. Got it. Okay, so yeah. it comes with this, and then you have to purchase this separately. Is that correct? Yes. Okay, now we've confirmed. Sorry. This is a new product. Trying to learn it. Figure it out. So, of course, with the centerpiece of the flowers, these are the flowers that you're going to get. You want to smell them out? Yeah. These are artificial flowers. Then, of course, you're going to go ahead, and we're going to start off with making this nice bouquet of roses here that we already have. Now, the coolest thing I like about this is each material is made with silk, foam, and plastic. So the roses itself is actually foam. And then, of course, you have the plastic going down. And some of these pieces, like this rose right here, is silk. So I'm going to come up there and show you guys the two differences. This flower right here is foam. This one is like a silk. And then of course, we're looking at the vines of the flower is plastic. So you're getting two types of flowers there. Okay. Yes, darling. Yes, you missed the little dog beds. So we're gonna go ahead and make a centerpiece really quickly to show everyone how easy it is to go ahead and make. Right, Charlie? Isn't it nice? Yes, these are little artificial flowers. Very pretty, huh? Yeah, you can smell them. Yes. See? They're cool. We can actually pull them out of the boss here. And of course, you know, when you're making centerpieces like this, bring all of your creativity to the table. That's the one thing that I always loved about when I had worked at uh, Queen Bee Flowers. She taught me how to put the centerpieces together, how to have the flowers, what colors go with each other. You know, you want to add the vibrancy to it. You know what I'm saying? And um, this is pretty cool. It's a nice arts and crafts thing to do, especially if you have kids that are interested in maybe wanting to make a gift for grandma or grandpa. So this is pretty awesome to have. So basically, as I mentioned, you can cut to size if you want to, but what I'm actually doing is I'm actually just folding the flowers as that. And because you have the plastic, um, it holds it together like that. And then we just plop it in there so that we can reuse the flowers for this vase, for a centerpiece as well. So let me just quickly put the centerpiece together here. Look at how nice that's already turning out. Yes. Or if you have um, an event to go to, a wedding, or you wanna put something together, you know, there's a lot of crafty, creative people out there, myself included. I always like to do, sometimes I like to do homemade gifts or sometimes I like to style plain birthday cakes. I know last year I did that for my spouse and my mom as well. I purchased a uh, plain 
cake that just said happy birthday mom um, or didn't have anything on there and then of course I brought it home I have already had some crafty ideas from Michael's and then I revamped the cake and it was actually really nice it was a more of a customized cake than anything because you want to put your own spin to it especially if you're a very um, creative individual right okay so we're gonna go ahead <laughs> And uh, we're just plopping things in here as quick as we can because we know that everyone's watching and wanting to know, you know, what's the next items? We've got a lot of items here for you. Right, Charlie? Yes, look at this. Yeah, I know you're curious. You're probably bored. You want some snacks and treats, huh? We're almost there, yes. Smiling pretty. Hi, you're smiling pretty for the camera. You got beautiful eyes. Yes, you do. You always got to keep the dogs entertained. Okay, so we're finishing up here, as you can see, Charlie. We got beautiful flowers going on for this little display. This is super duper nice. Look at that. So with these ones, I'll tell you real quick, they have a real looking silk flake, uh, sorry, real looking silk fake flowers. And of course you have the foam flowers as well. And it's soft material because they do want to make it um, look like it is an actual flower bouquet. So this is actually really cool and interesting. And the coolest thing about these, because these aren't real flowers, they're going to last. They are going to last, you know? Of course, and if you want to have a flower display somewhere in your house, these will literally last forever. I love that. Right? There we go. This is just putting a centerpiece bouquet um, on the fly. So this is how exactly, you know, we can add some more little fancy things to it, but we're just going to, we're doing this pretty quick here. Look at that. Isn't that pretty cool? These ones, we're going to stick in here. Oh, there we go. So of course, as I mentioned, it comes with two different materials here so that you can go ahead and play around with it. It is a multi-use, versatile, and of course, they did mention that the silk flowers are handmade. And of course the sizes may vary uh, slightly because of the color and the difference between the dyes as well. So what you do see, what you see on Amazon, you may get identical ones or you're gonna just get, cause I know that there are flowers like pink, but it does come in different types of pink. We got light pink, we got a little bit of the dark purple, and then we kind of have a rosy pink. All the colors are mixed in. So that's what they're trying to let you know that um, the colors that you see on Amazon may not be identical to what it is, but you're gonna get those flavors in there of the different colors. And this is really cool, I really like this. You can make different types of displays as we had it in the vase at first, and then we did a centerpiece as well. So let me just pull that up there for you guys so that you can see exactly how nice that centerpiece is. And of course, you can add like a little ribbon or a bow down at the bottom just to hide our little fake green grass that the flowers are actually sitting in. So it's a quick DIY and you can actually have it anywhere. It's a nice rose floral arrangement of natural flowers. So it provides a nice fresh look to your home or if you're you know, going to a fancy dinner party or something and you wanna bring some nice flowers so that they could have it as a centerpiece or just have it sitting at your house somewhere because you just don't like how real flowers are always consistently dying, this is good to have it. So this one, let me just see here. So of course it says no need for water and soil because the flowers aren't real. They're easy to maintain and they're not affected by the natural climate, which is really great because sometimes when you have plastic flowers that sit in the corner of your house with the sun that shines on them, sometimes the plastic flowers or the foam flowers can go yellow or it can discolor. And then by that time, 
your hard money that you purchased on these flowers to last for quite some time are now trashed because of the discoloration on the material. So I really like that, that it doesn't get affected by the natural climate. And of course, flowers are open for all seasons. So you can actually have flowers any time of the year. They're so realistic. They're perfect for wedding decorations, table arrangements, or elegant home decorations as well. So if you guys are interested in this beautiful display of the artificial flower bulk, you can go ahead and check it out on our Amazon page. Oh, and I will mention one thing as well. The number one important, it comes in so many colors. So this one right here that we're looking at is the uh, blush milk pink, that is the color, but it does come in champagne color where it's more of a nude with a white. And it also comes in a navy burnt orange. So of course you get the nice navy blues with the burnt orange. Um, of course they have purple dark blues. Ooh, they even have pastel yellow blue ribbons. You can do so many creative things by purchasing not just one pack, but if you had two or three packs, you could do so many cool things. If you're into centerpieces or wanting to create a gift with flowers, that is something I would recommend. I know that if you go to um, the dollar store like Dollarama, they sell similar flowers like this, but I think literally for like one or two of these, you're spending two to three dollars. So for the price that you're getting here on Amazon, by using our code Deal Stories, you're literally getting a whole bouquet, a small bunch, it's a bulk, for a way better price than having to go to Michael's or having to go to the dollar store and purchasing a bulk like this of flowers. So take a look on our Amazon storefront page, use our code Deal Stories for uh, the deal for seven days and take advantage of this beautiful creative idea. And it doesn't even have to be something that you want to display. It could even be a great creative idea that you could do with your family members. You could do with your kids, because I know kids love to always be creative. So this is something cool that you could sit down maybe with your daughter or your son, and then just go creative with it and make your own centerpiece that you can just have sitting in the house 